Hey, this is Derek Cole along with William Skipper and welcome to the Comfort Experts and today we're talking about heat pumps in the cold weather. Uh, we kind of hit it a few times with steam and different aspects, but the latest we've been seeing a lot of questions about are freezing temperatures in your heat pump. So William, should I turn my heat pump off when it's 32 degrees outside? No. Um, that is a misconception that a lot of people have is uh, they hear people talk about heat pumps no good below freezing. Well, a heat pump still will produce heat below freezing, just not the capacity that it normally would above freezing. So the worst thing on a light bill is your electric heat strips. If you can prolong or cut back the time that you use your heat strips, why wouldn't you? If you've got a source, even though I might have a three-ton unit and I'm below 30 degrees outside or 20 degrees and I'm putting out half of what it normally would because of the temperatures, why would I not want to limit my heat strips coming on? Um, but a heat pump will produce heat on those cold days. So stay away from that fairy tale of once it gets below freezing, I'm going to turn my emergency heat on and that's all I'm going to run. Uh, let that heat pump run. Let it, let it cycle those heat strips on when needed and let's save a little bit on your utilities yeah and it's gonna i mean the main thing is gonna happen a lot more it's gonna go through a defrost cycle correct uh, more than if it was 45 degrees outside um and that's completely normal i mean you shouldn't worry about the heat pump and is it working too hard you, you know it's a heat pump it's equipment it's made to work that's right uh, so there's nothing abnormal about it going into defrost and the heat strips coming on there's it's completely fine you're gonna be fine so yeah like he said do not turn off the heat pump just because it's 30 degrees outside that's right let us do his job but go to one hour air carolinas.com if you have any questions also there's quite a few articles on that website you can read as well on the same subject for more information visit one hour air carolinas.com that's one hour air carolinas.com